What up, y'all? I'm about to show you how to use your own personal brand for marketing and CapCut. Let's do it. All right, y'all. So here we go. We're going to get right into it. Before we do, I hope that y'all seen your boy fresh, man. Fresh this week. Y'all saw me last week. I was looking a little rough. Don't worry. All Star was here. We had a crazy time. But y'all, let's get right into it. All right. So check this out. Check this out. We saw on the last week's video where we got to on our last part of our marketing ad, everything was there. And all we have to do is basically add this last piece. Yes, that's my own tagline that I put at the end of all of my marketing ads, just like you should be. And after this video, I hope you understand how you can do it. It's super easy. Now look, that outro was already created. Y'all drop a like or comment if you wanna see how I created it and how I can show you to create your own. I showed you the template to, uh, to, to basically find it, but if you wanna know how to create it, I can show you, your boy can get you right. But y'all gotta let me know, y'all gotta let me know. All right, so let's jump right back into CapCut. And as y'all know, your boy is right here on the iPad like I always am. I'm getting it set up so that y'all can see and follow along with me. So right now, we are, let's take a look at where we last ended. Y'all really like that. For a quick headshot ad to show that, hey, I'm still taking headshots. I'm still in the picture game. Come book with your boy. This is super quick, super easy. And again, just to put something out there. Now, what I need to show y'all is how I add my own personal brand at the end. So really quick, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the custom edit button. That's going to bring the project onto its own separate timeline. As you can see, everything is there. All the pictures is there. All the music, everything is still there. The only thing that we're gonna do now, and this is gonna be super quick, super easy. We're gonna go ahead and hit that plus button. I'm gonna find that ending that you guys saw. Let's go, we're gonna hit that. Nope, wrong one, that's for me and the wife. We got a whole nother separate thing that we cooking up. Y'all stay tuned with that. Perfect, there's the ending. Let's get that added and let's see. Perfect. Now, let's turn the sound on there. We definitely want to be able to hear it. Let's turn that sound up. Let's do it again. Yeah, you see that? All right, now, the only thing we need to do, I don't like how it kind of, was kind of an abrupt change. So we're going to add a transition in there. As you see, I'm zooming in. I'm going to hit that button right there. And I'm just going to do a quick slide left. Perfect. That way... Perfect. Now, one minor thing I'm also going to do is I don't want the music to end right as we transition. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch the song out a little bit longer, and then I'm going to go to the fade button. I'm going to go fade out, and that way, let's go about two and a half seconds. That way, when it ends, the music will slowly fade out but it'll kind of fade out as the logo is showing and it's ending. So it all looks kind of sync. Look, let me show you really quick. Here we go with sound on. I think I like when it rains. You told me to go to the light. Yo, I really like that. I like that. Matter of fact, look, look, check this out, check this out. I'm gonna slow it up just a little bit and to completely customize it a little bit more, check this out. I'm actually gonna bring it down and I'm going to go ahead and split that and I'm going to turn the volume down just a little bit so we can start to fade that out quicker so that we can still hear the outro. Let me stop that really quick. We're also gonna fade that down more. Perfect. It likes to start right after you test it, so just make sure, keep that. We'll actually fade that in so it's not a drastic change. And let's try this from the beginning. One more time, I think we nailed it, y'all. Oh, 
almost, almost, we almost got it, y'all. Let's turn this down. Let's turn it down even more so that it can continue to fade out. And let's just go from here. Let's see. You know what, guys? I'm going to do you one better. I'm going to go ahead and take it out. And let's fade it down from there. Last, last time, third time. This is our third time. I think this is our third time. Third time's a charm. Let's see. I think I like when it rains. You told me to go to the light. We got it, y'all. We're going to go ahead and export. We export it out. As soon as we export it out. We'll get the final product. Let's go take a look one more time and I'm gonna put it up on the screen. You guys let me know what you think. I think I like when it rains. You told me to go to the light. Hey. I loved it guys. Again, I showed you quickly how you can quickly add your own personal branding to a template, plug and play, add your branding on there and you're ready to go. Let's put it out there for the world to see, book some more business. Again, if this was something that was helpful for you, like, subscribe, share this out, and I'll be back next week for another banger. Let's go y'all, yeah.